if I may say so, I'm particularly thrilled to see the British Asian Trust is getting so involved in this critical sector, which is particularly relevant, of course, for South Asia, where the magnitude of development challenges is, is massive and, and the potential for making a, uh, an impact through social impact investing is obviously equally uh, vast. So, ladies and gentlemen, I, I hope that through the trust we can impact not just the lives of children in India, but, or indeed in, in terms of empowerment of women in Pakistan and elsewhere, but also change the, the mindsets of philanthropists around the world. At the heart of our programme strategy is a real determination to continue applying business principles to the work. And that's why we are incredibly excited about social impact investment and the development impact bond that, that we've been working on. And, and do you see social finance as something that's complementary to, to, to traditional philanthropy or ultimately something that actually replaces it? No, I see it as an evolution in philanthropy. I don't think social finance displaces the grants model. I think it's complementary to the grants making model. But I think it brings a discipline. And once that penny drops, you begin to realize that you can link, as you are doing with this effort, which is the first in, in, in the world of this, uh, you know, of this scale, uh, you can link a social improvement to a financial return.